Jackson. Well, the weather is quite mixed this week. We're going to see Atlantic low steaming in from the west. At the moment, it's not too bad. We have a little ridge of high pressure over us, but pressure is falling out to the west. And those Atlantic lows will push their way eastwards, bringing spells of rain, quite heavy rain in the north, and often windy weather too, particularly later in the week when we could see gales around some exposed coast. So we will be watching developments closely. At the moment, though, high pressure is giving many places a fine day. And this is just seen outside in Manchester. Not clear blue skies, but a lot of bright weather, not that much cloud around. And although the satellite picture is looking rather gloomy, a lot of the cloud across the British Isles is thin and high. So many areas for today will be bright. There will be some sunshine now and again. And most places should stay dry too. I think there'll just be one or two light showers, especially for central and eastern areas of England. But most of the day, a bit of a change with the clouds streaming in from the Atlantic. That's the first hand of that change from the west. Now, not that warm in the northwest today, around 15 or 16, but in the sunnier spots by the south, 19 or 20 Celsius with a light breeze. Not too bad. That's 68 Fahrenheit. Now, tonight it will be fine in the south, but the sign of change and in the west as rain spills its way in. Heavy rain by the end of the night, especially in western Scotland, parts of Northern Ireland. A few areas of cloud and drizzly bits too out in the Irish Sea. The wind's picking up as well, with temperatures holding up at around 11 or 12 in the northwest. So it's quite a warm night. Tomorrow, when it starts off fine with some bright weather, especially in southeastern parts of Britain. Elsewhere, though, it'll be cloudy, it'll be gloomy, a lot of hill fog in the west too. And there'll be some heavy rain through many parts of Scotland and Northern Ireland and Northern England through the morning. Gradually through the day, that'll push eastwards, possibly not arriving though in the extreme southeast until well on into the evening. Then on Wednesday night, it'll spill eastwards, clearing away fairly quickly on Thursday. That'll give quite a windy but bright day for Thursday, a bit of a respite. But for Friday, remember, another low pushing in, quite a wet day and another windy one.